Hello Internet, my name is Spin Steel, and today I've not got one game to show you. I've not got two games, I've got 20 games in one with the Family Games Compendium 20 games. That's right, 20 games all in one collection. How exciting, I wonder who it's made by. Uh, oh no. Ah yes, the Family Games Compendium 20 games. Have you ever seen a more exciting cover art? Now we've talked about bad box art before with Mega Man, but at least Mega Man has box art. This is just great decks on a black background. Zero effort has been put into this whatsoever. And there's actually another version with a different box art, which looks like this. 20 games family game compendium, really highlighting how many games they've got in there. Uh, and it also seems off center slightly, which is weird. And it's also a cardboard box version, and it's in a cardboard box. And as you can see by the fact that it's in a cardboard box, I believe this is the version I have, minus the cardboard box. Um, except this is for everyone, not just for family, this one's for everyone. Yes. There's also, also, this German version, which comes in red, So I found on German eBay. Uh, so that's fun, still the exact same collection of games, but it's, um, you know, in red, so that's cool. Yeah. Classic Midas. If you don't know who Midas are, they are publishers of such classic games like Snowboard Racer 2, Lake Masters EX, and of course, Robot Warlords, which broke mysteriously. But it's okay, because I, I fixed it. It's fine. It's stuck back together. So yeah, not the best track record so far from what we've played on this channel. But who knows, maybe, maybe this is a solid collection of 20 games. I mean, there's 20 games, surely. Surely there's at least one in here. All right, let's have a look at what we got. So we got Baccarat, Blackjack, Concentration, Power GP, Kart Racer, Kino, Let It Bet, Old Maid, Page One, Poker, Seven in a Row, Slot Machine, ooh, exciting. Speed, Super Bike Challenge, Super Blackjack. I've got Blackjack and Super Blackjack, cool. Splash and video poker. Poker and video poker. Whoa. Okay, so yeah, a bunch of bunch of uh Kyle games and a few racing games. Cool, that's it's great. Uh right, let's have a look on the inside. Excuse me, Mega Man. Pop it down there. Okay, so the person who sold it to us gave us some bubble wrap. That's very nice. This is good actually. I wish more people did this because it protects the little uh bit in the middle because a lot of the time in the delivery, these things can break. Sometimes you can have a case that's completely spotless on the outside, but when you open the box, these little plastic things fall out because they've somehow broken in, in transport. Don't know how it happens, but having a bit of bubble wrap or like tissue paper or something in the case really helps. So if you do plan on selling PS1 games on eBay or somewhere, bubble wrap on the inside really helps. Anyway, disc one of three. Bit smudged up, but nothing too bad. Let's have a look at the book. Okay. Casino games, disc one. Okay, so disc one, we've got casino games. Card games are this too. Wouldn't card games also be in casino games? Whatever. Uh, Car Racer, Power GP, and Superbike Challenge are on disc three. So the racing games are on disc three. How much are you betting that those racing games are all identical? but with different vehicles. Like, they're all the same game, just with different cars or whatever. Hmm, we'll see. Anyway. All right, it's just explaining the different games. Okay, so it gives you, like, how to play at least. That's something. Yeah. Yeah, kind of a basic manual, but at least, at least it has one. Uh, more bubble wrap. Very nice, thank you, thank you, thank you. I'll uh, eat that later. Um, right, disc two. This will be the uh, card games, I think it said. Yeah, a bit, bit of a scuff mark there, but that's fine. Uh, disc three. Or three. Yeah. Yep, those are CDs. Can confirm. Um, yeah, I've, I mean, it doesn't fill me with a whole lot of excitement, but you never know. Let's have a look at disc one. Okay, Family Games Compendium CD1. Back, 
Baccarat roulette, let it bet. Okay, bye. <laughs> yeah, yeah. I didn't press anything there. It's just loading. Main menu, ranking, or free. Free, I guess. Um. Oh, okay. It's circle, not X. It's one. Of the, it's one of those games where circle is an X. Okay. Ooh, look! It's a casino. How exciting! Oh, hello. Welcome to our casino. How many people? Question mark. Do you, you know that? See, looks acceptable. Uh, it's an accept acceptable drawing of a person. It's already more detail in this game than I thought it would be. Okay. Well, there is one people. One. Are you sure? Yes. Please sign this sheet and give me your photo. Okay. Um, I have, a, of course, bums. <laughs> um. Well, none of these really look like me. I guess that guy is <laughs> close enough, I guess. And fill in your target amount of money. A million pounds. Short sure, to a hundred, is that a hundred thousand? Yeah, that'll do. Have you finished? Yes. Coconuts. <laughs> All right, sure. That's a, it's a great JPEG you got there. Now, have a lucky day. All right. So yeah, more uh, detail than I thought it would be. I was expecting just like a menu, a blank menu. <laughs> but no, this is okay so far. For, you know, for my this. All right, here we go. This is when the magic happens. Baccarat, roulette, let it bet, blackjack, video poker, or slot machine. Well, I don't know what most of those are. I know what roulette is, I know what blackjack is, and I know what poker is. And I guess slot machine. Um, let's try Baccarat. I've heard of it. I've just never, you know. Baccarat isn't popular, is as popular as blackjack in casinos. Because the world is simple and the minimum bet is reasonable. All cards except Joker to be used to bet on either banker or play, uh, the, or tie or tie up drawn. Hold on. All cards except Joker to be used bet on either banker or player, or tie up drawn. Well, there's, okay. The one whose total figure becomes closer to nine wins. Ace, nine cards are to be calculated as numbers. Oh, eight to nine, okay. Ten and the face cards as zero. The number in the second digit of the total figure should be considered considered as zero. Hey. Back around is it popular okay, which kind of circles. Can I start? There we go. I okay, the the balls went over my head, I'm not gonna lie. Don't know. I'm just gonna. I'm just gonna push buttons. We're gonna get to. We're gonna get to nine. That's that's what I got. Maximum. All the money. Okay, player banker. Well, that's it. Um. Player. I bet. Okay, I'm gonna bet all of it. A hundred dollars. Apparently I'm not. I'm gonna put a thousand one hundred dollars and okay. <laughs> I don't know what I just did. So tie. How's that a tie? You got ten. I got more than ten. 
three. Tie three. What? What's happening? Okay. Pat myself again. Um, like I can't choose anything other than three on that. I don't know what. I don't know what that is. I'm pushing all the buttons. Oh, okay. Um. Uh huh. A one. How? How was that? Was he, well, hold on. Was he, was he just gonna say "f you" something? Okay. You know what? I am too confused for this. I'm gonna leave. I'm gonna leave. I'm gonna leave. I'm gonna go back to the menu. There we go. Whew. I'm not a casino guy. I've, not, I've never been to a casino. Nor do I want to. Alright, roulette. Roulette I can understand. Roulette is one of the typical and also famous casino games. Casino game. Okay, the English translation, not the best. The dealer throws a ball into rot, rot eating, rotating. That took me an embarrassing amount of time to realise what that said. Wheel. <laughs> Slowly the ball loses its speed and yeah, okay, we, we, we understand. Yeah, okay, we can, we can skip this one. We, we, we know roulette. Roulette's easy. No limit. I'm going to put it all on... Oh, what's happening? Okay. Put it all on red, baby. Yeah. All of it. Boom. Go. Go. Make it go. Bet done. Yes. Come on, red. Yay! I got all the monies. I won a bunch of money. I doubled my money. Hell yeah. Nice. Okay. Um, put it all on... Help. There we go. Put it all on zero. Yeah, I believe in myself. Let's go. Zero. My lucky number. Lucky number zero, that's what I always say. I can't make it go. <laughs> there we go. Come on, zero. Come on, zero. Oh, 29. That's not lucky number at all. My right, game, I get it. What happens now? Lost all the money! <laughs> You're bankrupt! Congratulations! All your life savings are gone. <laughs> what an elaborate screen to say you, you lose. You have a bankrupt now. Game is over. I have a bankrupt. You lost all the money. We want you to come back again. So we can take more of your money. That's how casinos work. Game over. There's some very elaborate, like, game over screens. Um, can I do anything? I'm pressing buttons. Do I, do, do I literally have to go reset my PS1? Oh no. Okay, it just took a while. Boo. Okay, well. Alright, let's try let it bet. Let it bet is an original card game based on poker. Make a hand of poker with three cards of yours with three cards of yours and two cards of the dealers. If the three cards that you have make a hand, you win. If not, your victory all depends on the cards the dealer has. This is a game that requires the most luck and 
courageousness in casinos. You gotta be very courageous to go to the casino, I guess. Okay. He doesn't tell you what their hands are. He just gotta go. He's gotta figure it out. I know nothing about poker. And thus, I guess, let a bet. Okay. Okay, one, two, three. Uh, about a thousand. Um, which one am I? Okay, stay or stay bet back. I have no idea what any of these things mean. <laughs> it's explained nothing. Um, stay. Oh, of course, we've got seven, four, and a three. I have no idea. No clue. Uh, stay. Uh, stay. And now there's a nine. Stay. So those guys, those guys got double kings, I guess. So that's good for them. Alright, well, that's let it bet, I guess. I have no idea what's happening. Um, yeah, I'm gonna, I'm gonna go. <laughs> Clueless, no idea. Oh, let me check the manual. Okay, so the manual does explain how to play. But, I don't wanna. Blackjack. <laughs> Alright, let's do it. Nine. Nineteen. That guy's got twenty. What's double mean? Um. What's Dan? So do I not win? Do I get nothing by that? Oh, I do get something. Okay. Wait, why? I didn't come... Okay. Sure. I guess because we all beat the dealer, maybe? I don't know how... I don't know how betting works. You got a BJ! Lucky him. Split? I don't know what that means. Sure. We've got a 20 and an 18. I will stand. Okay, so we get, I guess because we got a higher number than the dealer, that means we win. Yeah, it's just F. <laughs> it's just F U. Like it's about to swear. Fuck. What the hell? It's supposed to be a family game compendium. You don't say the F word in the family games, surely? What kind of family are you in, Midas? Go around swearing at each other. What the hell? <laughs> That's, that's very strange. Stupid question, but what does double do? Oh, doubles to bet. Okay. 
I made a mistake. Okay, well, that's Blackjack. It's, you know, it plays like Blackjack. Let's see what else we got. Alright, let's try video poker. Make special combinations with five cards. Look at the first five cards and exchange unwanted cards only once and make a better hand. After you win, you can challenge double up game. In double up game, you bet all the money you have won and try to make it double. If you win, you can have double money, but if you lose, you will lose all the bets. This is a game of heaven or hell. So it's poker, but on a screen, basically. It's a bit rubbish, isn't it? Um. I don't know poker. But six seven, who are king and the queen. The six and seven are the same suit. I think that's good. Oh, okay, we hold, we'll hold those. No, let's hold those two, okay. Uh, now what? Go. We got six, seven, eight, isn't that, isn't that a thing? Okay. Well, four of a kind, straight flush, full house flush, straight three of a kind, two pair, J or better. Or better, okay. We got a pair, that's good, I think. We got eight, nine, ten, and we'll keep the pair. Game over. Did I win? Oh, it's two pair. Okay, well. Um, we another pair, so we'll keep those. Game over. Okay, well, that's enough. Of, that's enough of a video poker. Uh. Slot machine. Uh, slot machines are the worst. They're just the worst. <laughs> in the casino, they're the worst thing. Like, I don't understand. There's so many, like, slot machine games on mobile. I don't understand. You're betting fake money. And the only gameplay is you push a button. And watch the wheel spin. And sometimes you win a fake money, which you can bet. You can, you know, play more. Put in more fake money to win more fake money. Like, at least with actual slot machines, you win... You can potentially win actual money. As, you know, as unlikely as it is. With phone games, you're just putting in fake money. You don't win anything. It's been more digital nonsense. I don't, I don't understand. But there's like hundreds of them. <laughs> I mean, look through the, like, the app store and there's bloody thousands. I don't understand. Anyway. Operation is, but it, operation is quite easy. Put bets in the coin slot and pull the lever on the right side of the machine. All you have to do is just... All you have to do is just to wait the wheel to stop. English. Slot machine is the most gorgeous and attractive game in casinos. I'll take your word for it. Uh, okay. Insert monies. Okay. Seven. Bar. Three bars. Okay. Bar. I don't, I don't understand why we have three other players on this. Like, it's a slot machine. Why do we need to see what other people are doing? Two bars and... Okay. Like, this is it. This is the game. It's like, like I said before, with the mobile phone games, you just push a button and watch the thing spin around. And sometimes you get more fake money. 
Like, what's the point? There's no, there's no gameplay here. This isn't games. I'm pushing other buttons in case something happens, but yeah, no. Nah. <laughs> yeah, no, nah, yeah. Oh, we got two bars. Can we get a third bar? Nope. I'm done. I'm I am loose. Yep. Why? Why am I playing this game? Bruh. Next game. Next game. Yes, whatever. All right. So, wait. Hold on. How did that happen? Anyway. Uh. Yeah. Whoops. Uh. A bit of pants, wasn't it? Yeah, just very basic uh, casino games. I mean, it started off strong, the little bit at the beginning. Um, have I broken the disc? A little bit, it's fine. But the bit at the beginning, like where you make your, you put in your name, make a character and stuff like that, that was pretty promising. But then it's just it's just a very basic collection of, of casino games. Uh, I don't understand why every game needs to have three other computer players. Well, I've got to get it with some of them, like poker and, you know, some of them need to have other players. But things like slot machine, why would you need other players for a slot machine? And like video poker, I don't really get it. Um, but I mean, if you really like gambling and want to, you know, play casino games on your PS1. Yeah, I mean, sure, I guess, if you want. Um, these days you can just get apps on your phone with, you know, these kind of things. Uh, but yeah, I meh meh out of ten. Um, I, I don't know how I I didn't think I threw it that hard. Um, anyway, how did I even? I can't even get it back on. There we go, fixed it. Right, disc two. <laughs> it's so hard this disc fell out as well. Anyway, disc two. This is the card games. I think. Uh, yeah. All right, CD2, seven in a row, page one, speed, poker, again, blackjack, again, concentration, oh, sorry, I hiccuped, <laughs> you get the gist. What the hell are you? What on earth? Gah. <laughs> what on earth are these char characters? I've got the hiccups, excuse me. Yeah, terrifying. <laughs> Whoa, look at this guy who plays PS1. Whoa, and now they're angry. I guess. What the hell is happening? This is so different than the first disc. Okay, uh, seven in a row, seven bridges, splash, concentration, speed. Rich man, page one, old maid. Poker! Blackjack! Uh, right, let's try seven in a row. Finished second place after five rounds. I must finish first at level four. What? You gonna explain the rules or? I'm surprised at how different this is compared to disc one. Okay, there's Mona Lisa. Pfft, sure, I'll do it. Let's play. Start. Okay, well, I'm gonna assume you have to get seven cards in a row. Call me crazy. Oh, okay. So there's seven in the middle. You have to sit together, play a six or an eight. Oh, either of those suits. Okay, well, I've got a six. Six of hearts. Put that on there. There we go. And we hit a 5 or an 8. We've got a 5, okay. Slam that on there. And we've got a 4. Oh, we've got 4 and an 8, okay. We'll whack the 4 on there. I don't know what the end goal is here. I assume to get to the end or to have played the most cards.
Okay, well, we've got to one in. Go okay, past. Okay. No, I'm going to more hearts. Um. Yeah, I guess just keep going until you can't go anymore. Well, I can't go anymore, so... Pass. Okay, I'm gonna guess you get three passes, okay. I've got the king. That guy won, apparently. Oh, because you lost, you got rid of all the cards, okay, so yeah. This first person to spend all their cards. This means I lose, yay! <laughs> okay, well that's, that's, you know, a game. It's extremely basic, you don't even have to think about it, you just put the cards down, but... Yeah. Game. Alright. Next game. If you'll let me. Um, can I stop playing now, please? Okay, I'm not sure what I did, but... Alright, we're back. I have no idea what happened there. I think I pressed start and select at the same time. Whatever. Seven bridges. Pan and Chi possible during first round? What? Can you obtain cards when you have no special cards? I don't know, can you? Add cards to a 7 card? Go out without a throwaway card? Am I having a stroke? <laughs> What's going on? Finish second place after 10 rounds. Let's finish first at level 4. Okay. <laughs> Let's play. Start! Round 1. Okay, <laughs> just, just go, figure it out. Okay, um, six. Yes. Happy. Uh, oh, okay, I can play the six apparently. I will do that. And the ten. Pong. Happy. Guys, I'm scared. Yes! It's like a, a weird fever dream. Finish! Cool, thanks for the uh, flashing lights, appreciate it. Win! Minus seven. Okay, I wanna go. Boy, I have a panic attack, okay. <laughs> okay, yeah, start and select gets you out of the hellhole. Ugh. Alright. Splash. Rules. Take two. Suit change. Jump at next player. Reverse order of play. Alright. Triangle button. It's a call to finish and splash. Painting. Hee hee hee. Let's play. Start. This looks familiar. There is a spinning match stick. Just a match, I guess. Okay, I'm gonna play a five or nine. Five. Oh, is it matching the number or the suit? Okay, it's Uno. Well, I like Uno. It's literally Uno. <laughs> I can play that giant. Yeah, I like Uno. Uno is great. Okay. Huh. 
<laughs> I'd have to call Uno. Reverse. <laughs> yeah, like, okay. Pick a card. And pass. Okay. I've got to play the skip. Um, well, I can't play, so I'll take a card. Yeah, you have to call Uno. So that's what that's what Triangle does. That's what it, that's what it meant. Okay, and because I didn't call Uno, that guy called me out on it, and I had to pick up two cards. It is Uno. It's literally Uno. <laughs> All right, I'm I'm you know what? I'm okay with that. I think I like Uno. I'm getting screwed right now. That guy won. No, I didn't. I didn't realize Uno was like an actual card game, like, but which, you know, evolved into what Uno is. I didn't. Yeah, I didn't realize it was a card game before Uno was a thing. If that makes sense. I learned something today. Oh. Oh, this means I can change the the suit. Okay, it really is like Uno. Okay. Now I'll change a heart, please. Now I'll change that to heart again, please. Let's change it back. Uh, ah, oh, damn. Oh, no, I've got five. There we go. Ah. Oh. I will draw. I don't know what that means. I don't know what the two cards and four cards thing means. Oh wait, I've got I've got hearts there. Oh, it means I need to draw. Okay, I have to draw four card. Okay, I get it. So because he he played the plus two, she jumped in on the plus two, made it a plus four. I get it. Do we know? Literally. And that guy won again. Alright, last game. Wait, why can I play an 8? I, I guess that's like a wild card? Okay. Diamond. I'm guessing you can always play 8s. It's like a wild card. I get it. Um, yeah. Okay, now I have to call Uno. What can I play a nine? I don't, I don't know. <laughs> I guess that's another wild card. Ah. Oh. That guy wins again. Oh, a different guy. Okay. Okay. Yeah. Now we must punish you by giving you strobe lights. Rotating strobe lights. Enjoy. I hope you're not photo sensitive. Ugh, my brain. Okay. Alright, concentration. That's the most fun game yet. But it's only fun because it's literally Uno. Uh, yeah, one player. Draw the ace card to play first. Yay! I win the game. Okay, oh, this is like a matching. Match two game. You got to try and remember what cards are where. You an idiot. <laughs> you already knew that card was a two. You kept begging the cards, it's already been picked. His AI is not smart. Was one of the ones you picked a two of hearts already? Was this a two of hearts? No. <laughs> Never mind. I, I, my memory isn't good.
God, this is this is this is boring. This is, might be the most boring boring one yet. It's so basic, and I don't remember things. Come on. Like yeah, okay, I'm done. I'm done. That one sucks. It's literally match two. Is it match two game? All right, speed. No. Eight and five. What's happening? No. I don't understand. <laughs> yeah. No, I'm out. Okay. <laughs> I have no idea what's going on there. No clue. I wish this gave you like at least a screen that gave you the basic rules. But it just gives you nothing. It's like, okay, go. Just, just go. Like, I know we've got the instruction book, but at least tell you something on the you know, the game screen. Uh, right, page one. Take two, suit change, jump, next play, reverse, auto play. Oh wait, it's just in this one, right? This is the Uno one. Yeah, okay, this is, this is the Uno one. Right? Wait, no, it's not. It's like, you know, but with different walls. Yeah, it's just... I'm confused. Retallic cards are disappearing. Page one. Who know? Yeah, it's the same game except the same. I don't know. <laughs> the background's different. Um And it doesn't give you the option to play after you draw. That's literally the only difference I've noticed so far. And there's no jump ins. <laughs> or no um, plus twos. No stacking. That's what I'm trying to say. In Uno terms. Uno. Oh, I didn't, I didn't call page one. <laughs> it makes you take five cards if you don't call Uno. God. Let's see, if that was the other game, I could have stacked my plus two onto that plus two, and that guy would have had to draw four. Also, the game is continuing now that he's... After his, he's been knocked out, so it is slightly different. It's just Uno with different rules. It's just the other game with slightly different rules. Uh, that's lazy. You could have just had that one game and given it two different rule sets. He didn't need to include this as a different game. So saying 20 games is not true. It's 19 games. Actually, you got poker twice and blackjack twice. So it's like 17 games. <laughs> Okay, that's enough. You played Uno already. Alright, next one. Old Maid. Okay, round one. Fight. 
Um, okay. So I'm picking one of their cards. Um. Oh, he's trying to get pairs. Okay. I want to know what cards he's got. Oh, okay, so his face changes. So I guess... I'll go for that one, because he looks the most... dead, I don't know. Yeah, so if you get a pair, you can take, you can lose your cards. So again, it's just, it's just... random guesswork. Right, okay, yeah, it's pants. You just pick a card and hope you get a matching pair. Right. Well, poker again, I guess. But this time it's actual poker and not video poker. So it's different, you see. Bet. Deal. We've got one pair. It just tells you on this one what you've got. <laughs> uh, right, so we'll hold these then. Deal. Alright, one pair. I'll take it. Double up. Yeah. Why not? Hit and low. Red and black. Red and black. I know what that means. Select same color I lose <laughs> uh, okay yeah it's just poker it's just poker again you don't even get the little characters to play against it's just you against the computer it's no different than video poker for Christ's sake Ugh. whatever we're done with that it's poker Last one, blackjack. Twenty-one bonus. Uh, okay, bet and deal. Got twelve. Uh, hit me. Nineteen. I will stand. Double up. Sure. When I'm black. Nice. nice. Double up. Sure. Red and black. Great. Cool. Double up? No. I'll take my winnings. Hit me. Darn, I lost. Well, that's the card games. <laughs> Two of those were Uno. I'm not sure what came first. Did this come first? Did this game whip off Uno? Or did Uno take their rules from a card game? I don't know. And honestly, I don't care what to look up. Right, disc three. I missed, but it's fine. Um, yeah, more card games. Like, a lot of them were very similar to the casino games. I don't really know why we'd need the same game twice, like Blackjack, Super Blackjack. But, you know, they all, you know, functioned. I wish they gave you more of like a description of how the game works. I mean, I suppose it is in the manual, but something, you know, in-game I could look at to learn how the game actually work. But, you know, it's, yeah, more card games. If you like card games, go for it. The best ones on there were the ones that are basically different versions of Uno. But if you want to play Uno, play Uno. You know, it's on PS4, it's on Xbox, it's on Switch, made by Ubisoft. Unfortunately, the online kind of sucks because it keeps crashing and like disconnecting, it stopped working for no reason and it's been like that ever since it came out and it's still like that and it's not like it's not getting updated it's getting, it came out with an update like just the other day and, but the online still it's busted what are you doing Ubisoft? take 5 minutes away from making your next Assassin's Creed or Far Cry clone and bloody fix Uno no one wants your damn Avatar game 
Anyway, sidetracks. Uh, yeah, card games, isn't it? Uh, if, if you <laughs> if you want to play card games on your PS One, go for it. It's fine, I guess. Or just you play apps on your phone. I don't know. Uh, right, next, racing games. I guarantee you, these are all going to be the same game, just with different vehicles. Calling it now. Let's take a look. Okay, exciting. We've got Kart Racer, Superbike Challenge, or Power GP. Oh, I should get my Negcon controller out. Oh, I'll have to get it next time. Kart Racer. Whoa, exciting. Look at the excitement. They used up all their budget on the first two. With the animations. Um, English. Single race. Bums. Uh, amateur. Length of race, five, I guess. We've got Bantok Towers, we've got Muran Raceway, City Limits, Adana Clips, Forest Valley, and lots of tracks to choose from, I guess. Start race. Well, I can't wait to race my car. It's going to be so fun. Maybe my, my dislike in the corner. Whoa, look at the graphics. Um, I can change the view. I am pushing buttons. Oh, okay. I can change the gear. Here we go. Where's the rest of the racers? Is it just me? Okay, you have to change gears manually, I guess. Oh no, it's doing it itself now. This, this is, this is eerily familiar. What game was it before as I played? Where you have to like, change gears when you start, but then it starts changing gears automatically? I don't remember. This control is like us. <laughs> I mean, is this the race? Am I doing it right? Flex. There's not even any music. Or other people. Is this it? Is this the game? I don't know. I don't even know what to say about it. It's so dull. There's nothing to talk about. Okay, there's got to be something. Something I'm missing, surely. Bums. <laughs> Did not qualify. Qualify? Oh. Now there's cars. Sure. Now the real game begins, I guess. Still no music. But there are other drivers, so that's nice. Bye. Ah, oh, just so I don't even like it. having other cars there doesn't even matter really, let's face it. It is so basic. The game is so basic and bland, having other cars is just pointless. Like, okay, I'm in first place, or okay, I'm in eighth place. It makes no difference. Like, because like, I don't care. <laughs>
I'm going max speed. This sucks. Okay, we're gonna we're gonna play something else. All right, I've whipped out my Negcon. If you haven't seen my Negcon controller video, go watch that now. Um, but yeah, it's a racing controller made by Namco that twists. And there's some like pressure buttons. And surprisingly, the pressure buttons worked because they didn't work in other games. Okay, this time we're doing bikes. I have a sneaking suspicion it's going to be exactly the same. Yep, same tracks. Yep, the exact same tracks. Well, let's do Bantock Towers again. It's the same game. It's the same damn game, but with bikes. <laughs> you know what? The neck can't actually works really well. Except for one thing, I can't change gear. Because it's R2 to change the gear, and I don't have an R2 button on this controller. Man, I'm going go backwards. Oh, you know what? The turning on the, on the controller works. The twisting works. <laughs> I realize that won't, this won't make any sense to someone who hasn't watched my last video. But this controller, you twist the controller to make a turn. And it actually works with this game. Wow, look at that. Unfortunately, I don't have an R2 button, so I can't change gear. But I can do that. So yeah, we're kind of screwed. Hold on, let's see if I can change the controls. Why would it make you change out of neutral? That's so weird. Here we go. Oh, gear. It's got the picture of the Negcon. Look at that. Of all games to support the Negcon, my Midas Family Games Compendium was not one I expected. What? That's insane. I can't believe, of all things, of all games to support this controller, you know, that's a picture of it. Family Games Compendium supports the Negcon. What in the world? Okay. My mind is blown right now. Okay, now we know how to change gear. Let's do it. Like, even the pressure buttons work how they're supposed to. You can push it a little bit. Hold on. Yeah, you push it a little bit, it goes a little bit, all the way down. It works better than it did in Bloody Rage Racer. <laughs> oh, and now I'm dead. Okay, well. Wasn't that fun, kids? Alright, let's try again. Yeah, the turning works. <laughs> That's so insane. Sorry, I don't have my hand cams set up. I did, was not expecting this to work. I mean, I'm still... You still controls like arse, but... You controls like arse with a twisting controller. I mean... It's still the same boring game as it was... <laughs> you know, when I was driving the car around. But now I'm on a bike. So that's... Cool. I'm having more fun with this, but not, it's only because I'm using the, the uh, Negcon controller. <laughs> Can't believe this supports it, of all games. Well, I'm dead now. <laughs> Alright, let's try the next one. Alright, Power GP. The last one. Will this be any different? I doubt it. Yep. Same tracks again.
Okay, so it's another one like the kart racer. You just start you off by yourself. I suppose it's like a qualifying lap, maybe? But hey, the neck on still works. Yeah, look at that turn. Oop, never mind. It's, yeah, it's literally the same as the go-kart one. I can't call this 20 games in one. It's racing game but the same game but with different vehicles. That's so duh. That's so duh, Midas. Midas is, is such a duh company. Alright, let's just quit this. Let's start an actual race. Alright, other cars. Yep, this is just as boring as the other ones. At least I'm keeping up this time. Yeah, I'm in first. Never mind. Nope, still in first. Cool. Okay, well. <laughs> These are pretty much the most basic racing games you can get. They are very generic. There's literally nothing to talk about. Other than you driving around the track. There's nothing special. There's nothing special or unique about it. It's just the driving game. Like I would never play this over any other driving game. It's not like offensively bad as like um International Moto X was when we played that. Because that was generic and the controlled like it was you just controlled like arse. <laughs> they controlled bad and it was graphically bad and it handled bad. Everything about it was bad. That was the worst driving game I played. This is fine. It controls fine. It is a game where you drive around the track in a vehicle. There's nothing special about it. It's just you drive around the track. And that's it. That's the game. Yeah. That's really all there is to say about it. Alright, I guess I guess that's it. Uh yeah, that's kind of a kind of a dull ending. Midas, baby. Well, well, well. I can't believe the Negcon actually worked for this game. Not only does it work, it has a picture of the Negcon on it. It recognized the fact I was using this specific controller. That's mental. I was not expecting this to work. Honestly, when I bought this, I thought it was like some obscure controller that would work with like a couple games, maybe. But it seems like it works with just about anything. Maybe I should do a part two of this and find out how many games actually work with this. That'd be pretty cool. I might, we might see the Nankon again. This might not be the last time we see it. Anyway, unfortunately, the game's really boring. They're fine. They function. They, they're not the worst racing game I've played on PS1. That one belongs to International Moto X, which was hot garbage. We saw this in one of my last videos. I couldn't really describe it. How it feels? It was basically like moving. It didn't feel like a racing game. It didn't feel like you were driving a bike around the track. It felt like you were moving an object around the track with a very janky physics. And it just, it felt awful. This is the worst racing game I've ever played. Don't play this. This is better, but not by much. It's just, like, it feels like you're driving the car slash bike slash different car, but it's just like a hundred other racing games you could be playing instead not worth it so yeah also to call this three separate games is a crime they're the same game come on now oh i almost forgot so yeah the family games compendium 
it shouldn't be called a family games companion it should be called casino and driving simulator uh collection <laughs> i don't know it's definitely not what i would call family games it's just a collection of card games and stuff not really worth your money unless you really really like card games i suppose or want to pretend to gamble in a casino or if you've literally played every other racing game known to man so yeah just a, just another weird obscure relic from the past that really isn't worth your time but it's a fun to look at and fun to explore what else is out there well done Midas you've done it again <laughs> thanks very much for watching like the video if you liked the video subscribe if you want to see more big thanks to anyone who subscribed the likes and the subscriptions all really really help out and it's good to know that people are enjoying these videos and it encourages me to make more and the more subs we get the more likes we get the better the videos do the bigger the channel can grow the more videos we can make etc etc so yeah thanks very much i will see you next time goodbye